All right, so this is Traffics. This, uh, this is a game that, uh, was, is basically a puzzle game. Given its interface, I'm going to make a conjecture that this started as a mobile game, but it is indeed on Switch as well, or... I don't know if it's on Switch. It's on Steam, though, I can tell you that much. Sorry, my last howler was Switch, was howler for an hour. My terms are getting mixed up. Uh, I can say right off the bat with this game, this music that is currently played is royalty-free music from, I believe, uh, what's that one guy's site? Oh, man. David something? I can't remember. Anyways, whatever. Royalty-free music. I've heard it before. <laughs> But whatever, it works, I guess. Uh, let's, let's begin. Let's see what this is like. So, Traffics is a traffic puzzle game. And it has a three-star system just like... Man, why does every mobile game have a three-star system? What, what's up with the three-star thing? Seriously. Anyways, I can tap the light to let one car go. Okay. Incompetech. That's it. Thank you. Kevin McLeod. That's who I was trying to say. Not David. Kevin. Double tap light, let all cars go. Okay. Tap light again to stop the next cars. What if I don't want to? Drivers become impatient. Impatient drivers become angry. I'm gonna make them angry. Hold on. You're angry. I don't care. You're allowed 10 incidents per level. Making a driver angry counts as an incident? I'm sorry. Do you know how often people get upset? <laughs> hey, that wasn't my fault. I didn't click. Fuck you, game. Tap or swipe crash cars. Remove them. Oh, there's crash cars? Well, you know, let's just get rid of those. Boop. Sorry, you're obliterated now. The accident never happened. Nobody saw anything. Alright, let's let this guy go and let them go. go. Actually, that was, that was close. Or I can turn the light off right before. Oh, well, it's okay. Wait, no, I said I said one car go. What the fuck? Two of them went. That one, that one snuck through. That one snuck through the line. How rude! Whoa, whoa, whoa! That wasn't my fault either. The fuck, dude? Okay, I can't control these people. Okay, that's not a good sign when the tutorial is demonstrating some. Slight issues with the game. Oh boy. <laughs> no, well, I mean, it's realistic. He's not paying attention to the lights at all. Still, if I'm playing a... T what's chaos mode? Uh, anyways, let's... Let's divide 15 cars safely in Berlin. Sure. Hmm. <laughs> This seems easy enough. The timing is perfect. That, no, the hyper, that's what I was saying earlier. <laughs> well, it seems pretty perfectly timed, so I don't really, yeah, I don't think we're really any, no, just leave it green. It doesn't really fucking matter. Oh, never mind. It kind of mattered. <laughs> Is, oh, hold on there. Oh, Alright. Go, go, go. Got it, dude. You can make it. This is definitely easier than the tutorial, but I've already kind of failed a little bit. That's alright, though. I'm gonna guess... This, so this is a three-star system. I'm guessing don't make mistakes. Do it within a time limit. And... I don't know. But why is it? Why does every mobile game have to have the three star thing? Like, I don't mind the concept of like having multiple objectives to level. In fact, I'd rather like it. But why is it always three star system? It's so dumb. Okay. Road rage zero. Okay, so one star for gaining the objective complete. One star for not having road rage. One star for no accidents. Got it. I mean, can I like play again? Play chaos mode. Okay, I can play. Okay, let me. I'm legitimately curious about chaos, so let me try doing the three stars. That'll probably let me have it, right? If the cars back up, I'm legitimately concerned about drivers just running the light. 
Which, yes, that's realistic, but in a puzzle game, that should really not be happening. You saw that during the tutorial, where I, I turned it yellow, which means only one card can go through, and a second card behind it sucked past, because it was Fender bittering the guy. So I guess, I guess it also got triggered before the light changed. Everybody else is doing it, so fuck it. I guess that's pretty much just the logic with mobile, and development, mobile development in general. Everybody else is doing it. Let's copy it with the least amount of effort possible. I mean, let's be fair here. This is an this is an original game concept, as far as I can tell. That's what caught my attention about it. Somebody asked earlier, "How do I pick my How do I pick the games I pick for Halo for an hour?" It's a bit of a chaotic uh, question to answer. It's it kind of depends on my mood. It kind of depends on what looks interesting. I kind of just judge it as I go. Um. Oh, okay, so that did unlock Chaos Mode. Alright, let's go play again. I want to see... Oh, let's compare. What's Chaos Mode, then? Chaos Mode is... That's the police car, isn't it? They're gonna run the light, aren't they? No, I don't know. What is? What happens if I let them sit? I gotta wonder. Okay. Are they gonna, like, blow up or something? Like... I don't see what's so chaotic about this. They seem pretty patient, if anything. Ooh, that was a close one. I was like, I think you can make it. I mean, we have music during Chaos Mode. That seems to be the only real difference, aside from these alarm bells. That makes me think these are all police cars I'm navigating. I don't know. This is most likely more in Compatech, Kevin McLeod music, something like that. Yeah, and Compatech is the name of Kevin McLeod's site. He's a royalty-free guy. A lot of YouTubers use him for his music. Uh, he honestly does good music. It's just a little bit cheap to use his stuff because his stuff is so recognizable. I don't think I've heard this particular song, but I wouldn't be surprised if it was another one of his pieces. He's honestly a really good guy. Um, I got superstars this time. All right. Um, so if I go home for a second. So how many levels do we have here? Right. So you can get stars and then you can get superstars by doing the chaos mode. But it didn't seem like... I don't really understand what the point of chaos mode was. It didn't seem that different. Alright, so what do we got here? Oh, I see. A roundabout. I was very confused for a moment because I rarely ever see roundabouts. I wonder if they exist in Canada at all. I barely see them in America, so... I mean, it's probably safer just to go one car at a time, honestly. Ooh, that was, that was a, a hug. I feel like he's still gonna crash. Hold on, wait. No, he's fine, alright. I mean, the graphical design of this game is pretty nice. I like the clean look of it. I think it looks fine. It's obviously kind of a simple art style, but I think it looks nice. I like the gradients. So, so what this game is teaching us is don't mix the whites with the bl 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 blacks. Um, sure, let's go with that. <laughs> Jakarta. Where the fuck's Jakarta? Oh god, there's multiple lanes. Um, alright. This is simple. I'll just activate them at the same time. Everything will be fine. And go, go. And go. And go. And go. Can you imagine how shitty it would be if if traffic actually had to be manually- Like, every single traffic light had to be manually controlled by somebody in some sort of control booth? Can you imagine how shitty that would be? Like, honestly. Really just a matter of pressing the button at certain times. As soon as a black card passes, I press the button, and everything's fine. Alright, 
Oh, the tr the, the, do you see that truck? The truck did the- oh shit, I just caused a crash. Okay. That truck threw me off. Fuck that truck! Man! You should be at least able to trust trucks, you know, commercial drivers to not do that shit. Come on. I'm gonna try that again. That- see, that's exactly what I mean. Like, sometimes the game just fucks off of its rules and it's like, okay, this guy's just gonna slip through though. Because nobody gives a shit. Like that! I'm not sure if I, I... Here's the thing about a puzzle game, guys. In a puzzle game, the, the mechanics have to work correctly. Because the, the difficulty is solving the puzzles. All the mechanics should work perfectly flawlessly to make make it possible to solve the puzzle without any sort of doubt or suspicion or any sort of hesitation. So if a puzzle game's rules break, that's a real big problem. That's more of a problem than a game than like an action game or an RPG having its rules break. That's not nearly as big a deal usually. And if the game had said something like, oh, sometimes drivers will cut, be careful, then it would have been technically okay, I guess. But yeah, it's clearly not an intentional feature, it's just kind of happening. The puzzle itself is breaking the rules. There are games that do that, but I don't think this game is doing that intentionally. That's really the big thing. Athens. They have sh oh, oh, I have to be careful about the crossroads, I just realized. It'll be fine. This is fine. This isn't too bad. You know, unless somebody cuts and break and make everything falls apart. That's gonna happen again. We all know it's gonna happen. I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose a star simply because somebody cut. It's going to happen. We can't avoid this fact. Man, I have to really get a lot of cars in this one, don't I? I guess I should be doing this more- uh oh. <gasps> oh, that was close. I just realized, like, I should not have pressed it then, but it worked. Whatever. Oh my god, I almost caused a crash there too. Well, I have to be careful with trucks. Come drive on our road system. You'll have close calls, but don't worry, you won't actually make contact. Don't worry, if this is need for speed, you'll get extra points for near misses. <laughs> Wait, isn't this just the level I- oh, whoops, I, did I just play the same level twice? Whoops. Next level. Shanghai. If you do, no one will remember you anyways. I'm gonna skip the- definitely Chaos that one. I mean, I don't know what Chaos Mode does. We'll, we'll check out Chaos Mode again in a bit, but... Oh god, what am I looking at? Oh no, it's ups- there's ups and downs. I'm very confused. I mean, I guess I- okay, so it's safe for that direction, it's safe for that direction. So once they get past the first- no, this isn't as bad as it looks. As long as they make it past the first road, fine, they're fine. Ooh, okay. I don't have to pay attention to the, la the ladder because it's a- it's a bridge. Um... Oops, I kind of forgot about- Oh, these guys! Okay. Back and forth. That's the rule here. If we want people- Oh, I caused a crash. Alright then. Restart. <laughs> I mean, technically I don't need to restart. I don't have to do perfectly, but I kind of want to. I want to get the flow. I want to get the rhythm. And go, and go. And go and wait and go and go and you'll have to wait about it a little bit there, buddy. Go and wait and go and as long as I alternate, I cause a crash. <laughs> Damn bridge hit that car. I think I think even the like green is just kind of a bad idea. And go, and go, 
and go, and go, and go, and go, and go, and no! My rhythm! <laughs> <laughs> I like how nobody has the ability to stop or anything. Like, you know. There must be automated cars. This is the near future. It's all automation. That's why that's why they don't stop. Oh, you'll just have to wait, I'm sorry. Wow, look at this traffic line on the on the pink road. It's not good. It's very hard to get around it. You know, just risk risk it. For the biscuit. Okay, I can't do much with that side for a while. Oh, again! Fucking cutter! Did you see that? I hope they don't do that on that side, because I would be in real trouble if they did. I know. You're upset. Do you see this traffic? Hey! Don't bitch at me! Bitch at the cars who are spacing themselves just right that you can never get out of the road. It's not my fault. See, now you had a fucking collision because you're impatient. Alright. It's fucking your fault, dude. <laughs> Do you, seriously, the traffic was dispersed, dis dispersed just right. I couldn't really do anything there. You notice that? Sometimes it just gets... I, I don't like the randomization of how the traffic's set up, because it does just kind of set up in a way that I can't get cars through. Oh, fuck it. Let's go with two. If there's a line, I will consider doing two at once. I'm definitely going to do two at once here. Go, go! Stop! Okay. Alright. Oh, I missed the chance I had there. Alright, you're- go, go! Two- two at a time, there. Stop. Let's go! Okay, cool. Somebody else wasn't. Somebody else in this in this in this business was not doing their job right. With all these cars are all dispersed, they're interspersed. It's not my fault they're like this. Somebody else did a bad, poor job on a previous light. That's that's what happened here. Risk it for the biscuit. Yeah, sometimes the cars just pull up really close to each other, and then if that happens, they'll both go when I turn the light. Another cut happened. Did it? What do you mean, cut? Reese, what do you mean by that? Also, hi, Ben. Seems they only cut when it's okay. Did a cut happen? I didn't even see the cut. Alright, Numidon. This game reminds me of I, I Love Tr I didn't even see the one that cut! I was too busy looking at the other side at that time. Fucking cutters, man! They cut more than Cutman cuts. <laughs> Cutman cuts a lot of things. But now we have the... It's kind of like that other one, except for we have more lanes and now there's a bridge blocking my view. Okay, well, I didn't see... For instance, I didn't see that truck, I guess. Or Wait, no, was that a cut? Was that a cut right there? I feel like that was actually a cut. Did a cut happen there? I feel like either a cut happened or I just fucked up. One or the other happened. Oops, that was my fault. That was a cut. I was like, wait a minute, why did a collision happen? I wasn't playing that. So, uh, what I'm gonna say is that this game overall has a pretty slick design and looks pretty nice. And it, the controls are functional, like, there's no harm in- It's very simple controls, I'm just clicking. So there's nothing here that- You know, I think cuts are more likely to happen when the road's curved. I think I'm learning this. Three, let's go through three. Yeah, we got three. Cool. I fell. No, fucking okay, cut. <laughs> Okay. The cutters, though, man. The cutters are just... Oh, come on! 
Oh my god. <laughs> if you had just tapped your brakes, you would have been fine. Just a little tap. <laughs> I swear. Like fucking cutters! Oh, this guy's gonna cut too, watch. No, he didn't actually, okay. Ooh. Hey, if a collision happens after they're fully in the lane, do you think it's still my fault? I'm gonna risk it too. Wait, stop. Okay, go. I know, I know you're upset at me. Alright, just go. I'll, I'll, be the victims of your own fate. I don't, I don't really know what I'm saying. <laughs> uh, oh, okay, we're fine. Whoops, I didn't mean to hit that twice. Be the victims of your own fate. That's quite a poetic statement, I said. <laughs> so the cutting, it's kind of amusing, but also it kind of breaks the whole nature of this game. I'll be honest with you. Like it's. Kind of not good for the develop for the this game and cutting. It's not it's not a good combo, yo. You know. You know I'm just gonna do once at one at a time, one at a time, always, because I think anything else is kind of bad to do. Also, I feel like the levels go on a little too long in my book. I get that it, it's giving more chances to screw up, so it kind of adds to the difficulty. But fucking cutting trucks. But with all the cutters, having the levels longer also make, increases the risk of just something going awry, you know? Oh, shouldn't have made these guys wait. Oh well. Yeah, there we go. Okay, go. 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 Uh, go. Go. Okay, cool. Well, um, the bridges are really annoying, I have to say. I mean, they, they, you can... 80 cars! Oh my god, they really want me to do a lot. Oh, what the fuck is this? Uh, just everybody go. We'll figure it out in the pose. Oh my god, there's a train! <laughs> well, alright then. Yeah, that's fine, just keep going. <laughs> that explains a lot, though. Wait, can't th aren't these guys just going straight? Yeah, I just have them always go, whatever. I'll figure out the others as I go. Oh, wait. Oh, come on now. <laughs> I'll just have that lane always going, and I'll just work with that lane. It's fine. I mean, how many trains can there really be? You probably should stop. Uh, that's fine. <laughs> how many trains can there really be? It's fine. Don't worry about it, guys. We'll just, uh, we'll get him through where it's safe, you know? It's all good. <laughs> like, I'm gonna ram it inside this train. That will, that will, I'll definitely, I'll definitely knock it out of my way. You can mess the stage up pretty bad, I have to say. That was probably a mistake. Oh, they merged perfectly. Look at that. Nope, we're gonna stop you right there. And you guys go ahead. I'll go ahead and let you go. I'm in a hurry! I'm in a hurry! I'm in a Yeah, you crash. It's your fault, you fuck. These are not even that long of lights. What are up with all these impatient people, I swear. Hi, Fist. How you doing? Alright. Two, two or three can go. Wow, that was really threading it, wasn't it? Oh, he almost made it. So close. Oh, Tubby, that's very kind of you. I do realize that having the bottom lane open does make it harder in a way, but, uh... I'm just gonna focus that, and let's have this guy go. Oh, come on. It really is hard to time, though, because there's so much road. You know what I'm doing? Do? I'm just gonna stop the green whenever the train isn't there. So I'm gonna let this guy go through, and then I'll stop it, and then I'll let this guy go through, and this guy go through, and I'll just let him go. 
And the train's coming, so I'll stop. And this guy, these guys can head, head on through while that train's going by, and then I'll stop it. And I'll let these guys go back through. And then when the trains come through, so I'll stop those, and these guys can go through. And I'll stop that, and these guys can start going. This is probably how, this is much better. This is a much better system. These guys can start going. And it trains through, so we'll start getting these guys going again. Trains coming, so stop those. These guys can start going. Yeah, this is this is much better. <laughs> Alright, those guys are start going. Why are there so many fucking trains though? Like seriously. Like what the fuck is going on? There's a lot of freight being pulled today. I gotta say. Oh that, oh, that truck. Oh, get moving, buddy. You know, that collision. I could let. I technically could have a collision as the game ends. That would be kind of funny if I had that happen. I wonder if that would count or not. Me and Aaron got stuck behind six trains yesterday. Well, at least these trains were moving quickly. <laughs> trains are supposed to be long, though, because half of each train is indeed an engine. Cairo! Uh, I mean, I guess let's let those guys go, and I'll just let these guys go whenever. Yeah, that seems good. Go, go. Go, go. Go, go. I mean, it's a pretty, pretty decent puzzle game. All set. Okay, well, I, that was my fault. I, I waited too long. No cutters in that stage? Really, we had no... Well, people saw the train and they took it seriously, I guess. Maybe I shouldn't. Well, I mean, those... Except for the ones that, like, literally crash into trains. Alright. Keep forgetting they take those turns faster than I expect. Wait, actually, stop. Alright. Go. Oh, whoa, 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 what happened up there? Okay, hold on. <laughs> Maybe there is a... Okay. I mean, this should work, right? If I just time this right? I think. I think. Maybe not. I don't understand roundabouts. <laughs> no, I am intentionally leaving one green because I thought that would work, but it's not working for some reason. Big crowd, but oh, I know why it's not working, because I don't know where people are turning off at. So sometimes it's not working because people are turning off in the wrong place. I oh, that guy cut. I'm not at fault for whatever happens with that. Oh, I know how I'm messing this up. All right. So, like, that guy's going to crash, right? Yeah, okay, I get it. It's fine. I hate roundabouts. I think roundabouts are the devil, most likely. If I recall correctly, roundabouts are kind of bad. Just gotta look ahead. This shit is fine. This is fine. Or not. Oh, I didn't look- I looked ahead, but I didn't look in front of me. That's a problem. Right? You know what? New strategy. You go. You go. You wait, you go. Uh, you can go because you were next. You can go now. 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 Wait a minute. That works pretty well. I do it like that. I think about a rhythm. Because I always seem to turn off at the same place, so... I'm just not a, I'm not even paying attention. Bup, bup, bup. I'm not even paying attention, I'm just clicking at the right time. Bup, bup, bup. Bup, bup, bup. I, I guess this is working. 
Boop, doo, doo. Dop, doop, bop. Doop, boop, deep. Deep, loop, bop. Yep, that worked. That was definitely the optimal order. Ten roundabouts here, I still like roundabouts. Mexico City, my favorite. Um, you guys can just keep going, and I'll figure out the rest of you as I go. Oh, you guys want to turn right? Okay, I gotcha. Alright, you know, if a black car hits a white car, it's fine. Let's just see what happens. Okay, white car hit a white car, that's not so bad. good. So I think if- let's actually try something. If I leave that open, will- will we have collisions? Well, that's- that's gonna be a collision. No, actually, no, I don't think it will. Nope, that's fine. Wait, can I just leave this going? I mean, no, it can't, but I can- I am legitimately curious how long that lane will not collide with a black car. So far, they're doing very good. Well... <laughs> I, I just think they look- they look really confusing. And a lot of- a lot of, uh, a lot of, a lot of, um... I find that a lot of, uh... Oops, stop. I find that a lot of uh, roundabouts have a lot of have foliage or something that is. Oh, okay. Well, I finally. <laughs> All right then. But, you know, this, these guys are fine. These guys are. Oh well. Okay, never mind. <laughs> oh my God, D. No. All right, new strategy. We'll just go like this. All right, I did it too fast. But uh, what was I saying? I don't remember. Something, something, something. Words. Tell you what, I'm just gonna concentrate for a bit. <laughs> I mean, this is actually fairly fun. But I cannot get around the cutters. That's a that's a that is a officially a design flaw, you know. And so I can't really I can't really support it. I damn it. <laughs> so, the main reason I'm trying to three star things is because it kind of it exec, it's an execution of mastery, which means I feel like feel like I'm a fair judge of the level and the game as a whole if I can pull off a three star, you know. If I suck through every level and then I give a review, it's going to be less credible than if I can three-star level. Also, I am OCD. That's another reason, so maybe I'm just defending that. <laughs> also, it's really easy to, like, rush when... There's a bunch of cars piling up and they get upset. Put two, two at a time, because I'm being all risky and stuff. Ooh, that was actually pretty risky. And that guy cut. And that guy also cut! Wow, all the cutters! That could have very easily ended in a collision. I'm surprised it didn't. That level will sabotage itself. Good. That's really not good. That 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 break of mechanic is really not a good thing. What are we doing? Oh, I have to let them through two lanes now. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I never saw that issue. Are you sure cuts can cause crashes? Yes. They absolutely can. I don't even have to see one happen to tell you that it's entirely possible. 
Why couldn't why why couldn't they cause cuts? They if it's a physical they're creating a physical obstacle with those cuts. So yeah, they already did anyways. Yeah. Okay, I think there's a rhythm for this one too. The main problem is once you do kind of figure out a rhythm for a level, it just kind of goes on too long. That's my main issue. It's like this is not a breezy. This is not a breezy, nice setup where it just goes. You can just go through them, the levels in a nice breezy order. They last a little too long. It's also the reason I'm not doing the chaos modes. I just want to move forward. I'm starting to have a decent cap. I'm going to have to wait, make a car wait somewhere here. That's all right, though. Thread the needle, yo. There you go. I wonder if they get impatient on the first wait, if they'll be they'll remain impatient for the second wait, or if it resets. That's a decent question to ask. Okay, I just re can't remember. Also, to me, this game is very breezy. I mean, it is. It's just the levels last a little too long sometimes. That one didn't last too long. Okay, only 20 cars for Havana. All right. How bad can this? There's a fucking plane. How bad can this be? Oh, there's a plane. <laughs> what? Right? Okay. I mean, the game's throwing me for a loop. That's, that's usually a sign of something. Wait, there's not enough space for two cars to back up. Oh my. That's that's actually kind of interesting. Uh. So wait, what happens if I let a whole bunch through the top? So what happens if they climb a plane? Will there be an explosion? I must know. Go for it! Beat that plane! <laughs> the plane just does not give a shit. Alright. And they'll just... Okay. Alright. Whee! <laughs> well, they're really piling up now. <laughs> the planes are fine, though. Whatever, uh, 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 Air Tower, we had, uh, we had a collision with a Honda Civic. Uh, still requesting permission to fly, uh, to, uh, to take off. <laughs> oh, wait, I went too late on that one. <laughs> yeah, I can fit two cars, barely. Maybe those are airport vehicles? Sure, a lot of airport vehicles going around, though, if that was the case. I'll go in groups of two. Well, I'll just slip the cars through where they fit. I see why they only let me- they only need 20. It's a little harder. Oh, whoops, I kind of left that green, didn't I? Wow, that guy really took a ride. <laughs> oh, there's a colorblind mode? Hold on a minute. I'm kind of curious. How's that work? Oh, that's- Oh, that's actually- okay, I will give them credit. There's a colorblind mode for the lights. So you can see what they're doing. Even if you don't have the ability to see color. That's surprisingly forward thinking of them. I can actually compliment that feature. That's like really good. Oh, well, okay, I guess two cars can't fit in the car lane, just sometimes they can. Oh yeah, let's uh, switch colorblind mode off, because I, I do better with the colors. 
Hey, colorblind mode. Sweet. Sweet. Uh oh. Move, move, move! Right. No, not you! Fuck. <laughs> Hi, car! <laughs> Welcome back. This game gives me mixed opinions. It definitely has. It has the cutting thing is a definite break in the puzzle mechanics. I, I definitely cannot. I, de I can't stress enough that a puzzle game's mechanics need to work function as intended. If there is any rough edges for a puzzle game's mechanics, that will lead to frustration. But, um, besides that, this is actually fairly fun. <laughs> Be it only pulled forward. You can go too, there you go. And that's exactly what I mean. That right there was a cut. This is the this is where the mechanic breaks. Sometimes I only let one car through, but two go through. I, I love this guy over here. This giant traffic jam happening down here, and this guy up here is like, Man, why do I have to wait? I mean, there's only like 11 cars in an accident. Come on. Actually, that's... Sadly, that sounds a lot like real life. Dude, only only one person fucking died. Let me... I need to get to work. <laughs> you can prevent the cuts. How? Do tell. I can't turn the light from yellow to, to back to red fast. That's not an option if you're wondering. Because if I do that, it goes to green. If the cars are close in motion, use the green light. No, I want them to go one at a time. That's the thing. I don't want them to. I don't want to use the green light. That'll definitely make them go together. That's not going to help me at all, Lesler. I can't predict cuts. Sometimes the cars will stack up on each other, and sometimes they won't. It's actually really hard to tell. Like, if you if you pay attention to when cars stop behind each other, sometimes they will stop closer or farther away from each other. I really don't know how to, like, control that. Also, can we just can we appreciate the fact that it sure is a fucking a lot of fucking people needing to taxi a lot of a lot of planes taking off. This must be like fucking New York or something. Actually, no, it's Havana. Does Havana have this many planes? I'm I'm losing I'm losing time. Okay, well, when they cut, it's based on momentum. Oh, well, I mean, yeah, that makes sense, but it's still not cool. It's still breaking the mechanic. They shouldn't be doing that either way. It's gonna barely make it. Oh, no, you're not gonna make it. Sometimes, though, here's another thing to provide to explain the unpredictable nature. Sometimes these cars will stack up here in the bottom with enough space for a plane to pass, and sometimes they won't. So there really is a variance in the momentum of the vehicles that I cannot control. I cannot control how far apart they will end up stopped next to each other, even under the same conditions. In other words, there is randomization. And that is that's a bit of a pickle that. Well, at least I saved the car that was gonna get hit by the plane. <laughs> 
Charm is a ghost. He can already eat, and he already can eat electricity. What the fuck did you just say? What does that even mean? As we all know, ghosts are best known for their feature of eating electricity. The cards are also slightly variant sizes. That's probably what's really causing the uh, issues we're seeing, but... Oh, well. I double tapped when I meant to just not tap. <laughs> you know, I only have to get 20 cars through. Would have figured I'd gotten this by now. Oh, come on. That was... That was a, barely a touch. Damn. He ate a Rotom. When did I eat a Rotom? When did I eat a Rotom? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I love that green. <laughs> Sorry, I'm confused. It breaks my brain. One time? Did I? I don't know. It sounds like you're making something up. <laughs> is there anything you haven't ate? I mean, eating a Rotom is entirely possible for me, but I'm just saying I don't remember doing this. Oh, that's, that was kind of... Oh, no. We're fucked. We're fucked. <laughs> the traffic lines are variant as well, so if I pull two cars out through this, which is kind of important because otherwise I'm going to have people get impatient. Sometimes the traffic line of black cars is just basically saying fuck you to me. Sometimes the, the line is a metaphorical middle finger of how it's spaced out. <gasps> Ooh, look at him dodge that plane, just barely. Good work, buddy. That was exceptionally close in multiple ways, but it works. Oh, I left it green again. Okay. <laughs> this is harder than it seems. Holy shit. Some planes are slightly larger or smaller. Are they? I mean, I guess that would make sense. I guess pay attention and see. The subtle differences are hard to notice when you're also trying to control traffic. You guys can pay attention to this. I can't. If there are subtle differences that matter, then maybe they should be, t uh, I don't know, pointed out more clearly somehow with the game mechanics. I mean, there's already a good visual design with the black cars being cars I don't interact with while white cars I do. But beyond that, if there are different variances in sizes aside from just, you know, car and truck, perhaps that should be spelled out in some way. Damn it. I can't... Ah. Ah. Imagine if you need to let 80 through this level. Oh my god. At least they do consider the number of cars based on difficulty of the level and how fast you can get the cars through. 20 is still a lot in this case. If it was 80, I would die. If I had just left it green, if I if I had hit that yellow, it would have been fine. Damn it, that was my own hesitation. Small, midum, and truck. Yes. Yeah, I cut this way closer than I need to a lot of times. Yeah. 
Wait. Actually, yeah, go. I messed that up a little bit, but I didn't get all crash somehow. Fuck you! That was a that was a cut. I had that under control. And then the cut. And then the cut. <laughs> that was an adorable fuck you. What if Tucker said it? That'd be adorable. Adorable fuck you, so have Tucker voice say it. Oh, fuck you! I don't know. It'd be something like that. Wow, that sounded really upset. <laughs> that was a really upset voice. Granted, I guess Tucker would have to be really upset to say something like that. Yeah, Tucker's too innocent to use that language, though, really. That is really kind of the truth. And we have a cutter! Ladies and gentlemen, look at this lovely cutter! He caused a collision. Good work, buddy. Your mind is getting hurt from what argument? I don't know what you're talking about, but okay. It was close, but it worked. Oh, that's really close to each other. Go, go, go! Right, there you go. Yeah, no, that's fine. Let's go with one. He might get a little upset. It's all right. No biggie. Okay, cool. Oh, the electricity thing? Is that what is that what's affecting your voice as? <clears throat> Look guys, <clears throat> this whole lightning discussion. There's really not a lot of not a lot of uh, grounding in in reality with it. Let's just skip it. <laughs> See what I did there? All right, we're in Berlin, home of really shitty road systems, apparently. This is still better than planes, though. Holy shit. Actually, this is a really easy level. I just kind of fucked it up there, though. <clears throat> Berlin is bad, bad ability anything that should work. All right, well, I mean... I mean, the Autobahn's okay. Crash. Really, what this puzzle game basically boils down to in most cases is where can you click and where can cars go at? Click that first. Make sure to click that quickly. 
It's basically where it comes down to. I don't really understand what Chaos What is, because it doesn't seem like it really changes much except for gives music. To hide the existential dread we're all feeling as we play this game about it. Say what? What? Infamous for its new airport. What's its new airport on golf? I'm kind of curious. Audubon is not a Berlin thing. Yeah, I said that statement hesitantly. I wasn't sure if where the Audubon goes. Is is it even near Berlin? Save the guy, 50 cards to their destination. Hyper, please. <laughs> 50, wait, to do a Delhi. Okay. What the fuck is this road? I don't under, oh my god, there's a train. Okay, it's actually, wait. Oh, it's just, it's just a train. No big deal. No big deal, guys. It's a, it's a general train. It's just a general train, it's not a bad train. There's a lot of fucking directions to think about. I don't know if I like this. Okay. <laughs> Looks like a synapse. That's oddly specific and yet very true. The train is there to fuck with my brain. I see movement and I freak out, but it's actually harmless. The, the train is completely harmless. It's below, uh, it's below the roads. But it's hard to think correctly with that. It's actually pretty clever. A pretty clever mindfuck. Gotta be honest. The airport should have been finished years ago. It's still in construction. And the cost is already multiple by its effort. Actually, I think I may have watched a video on this airport. They completely screwed the pooch on that. And trust me, I know things about screwing pooches. Wow, that is like the worst line I probably have said on stream. <laughs> Congratulations, me. You never know what you're gonna hear out of my mouth. <laughs> Wasn't my collision, you, you caused it. <laughs> No, actually, Breezing, you made a perfect point. I actually have... Look, guys, I'm legitimate when I say that if I see a squirrel out the window, I'm probably going to get my eyes... My eyes are probably going to focus on icons that crash. <laughs> so, when it comes to movement, I do detect it. I pick up on it. Even Whether or not I, I want to focus on it, I will see the movement. I will focus the movement. So, in a game like this... With some extra movement going on, but that's that trade, that's really screwing me. Those two will, should really be hitting right now, but you know they're not, so that's what matters. Yeah, if I go if I go counterclockwise, it's much it's a much better system. Uh, I know, I know, you're you're upset that you're waiting. Well, I'm upset that you're upset. So, how about that? Come on. Okay. Okay, we got this. We, we got... We're falling apart, but we got this. Damn it! <laughs> What's going on, guys? What's going on? Just relax, guys. The debate's over. Debate is over! It's fine. It was just about electricity anyways. It's not really that important. Who, fu who fucking needs electricity? It's not important at all. My brain is still breaking, though. Unfortunately. 
No, you merged. You should have unmerged. I don't know. Here's a joke for you. Why would the latex creatures from Changed be good at running a traffic simulator? Because they're good at merging! Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I did everything wrong. Hold on. I must correct my mistake. Damn it. Also, I'm done. <laughs> I don't feel like trying that again. That was traffic. We had the timer go. The hell ended. What do you guys think of it? Do you think it's a good game? Well, let's see here. I beat all the way down to Do Delhi. You could say I beat around half the levels in this one hour, right? I didn't beat Chaos Mode on them, so I guess you could replay the level for Chaos Mode. But it's basically the same level, so I beat more or less half the game in that much time. Let's look at something real fast. Traffics costs. No, traffics. I want to search. Traffics. There you go. Okay. Traffics costs four ninety nine. Good concepts. Mediocre graphics. Shit game. I agree with that statement for the most part. I wouldn't call it shit, but I would call it imperfect, unpolished. Be simply because of that cut mechanic. Everything else here is pretty polished, but because the car is cut, I really can't give this my recommendation. Uh, because if you have a puzzle game where the mechanics break, that's not a good puzzle game. Puzzle games need their mechanics to be flawless in execution. At least the ones that are tied to the puzzle themselves. Uh, yeah, it's alright, but $5 for a game that can probably be beaten in a couple hours. Not counting the chaos mode if you want 100% everything. I don't know, there's just not a lot here for that price tag. I would honestly say that that's too high, but that's just my opinion. So that was Traffics. You can pay what you want on this. Maybe get on a deal if you really enjoy puzzle games. I don't know. 